here m minus n subtract 125 from 753 so from means what this will be the m 753 is m n is what 125 i told here steps right first step is what the m should be added with what r's complement of n so here which number system they have given decimal number system so tens complement of n so first i should find out what nines complement and then i should add one here so nines complement is what each digit of a number is subtracted from 9. So, you are getting what? 874. Now, 10's complement of n is what? Adding 1 to 9's complement of n. That is nothing but 875. So, I should add m with r's complement of n. That is m plus 10's complement of n. So, m is what? 753 plus 10's complement of n is what? 875. Right? So, I should do what? Addition 8, second one is 5, 7 is 12, 2, 1 here, 8, 8 is nothing but what here? 16, right? I told if m is greater than or equal to n, check here, 753 is greater than 125, then in that case carry is generated, right? Second step, carry is going to be produced, you should ignore this carry and the remaining result will be what? The result of m minus n that is nothing but 628 is result of 753 minus 125. So, if you do manually also, you are getting what? 753 minus 125 is 628, right? First case I have done where m is greater than or equal to n. Second case when you are coming, m is less than n, right? So, here I should subtract 72,532 from 13,250 from subtract this from this. So, <coughs> 13250 minus 72532 right m minus n right first step is what adding m with as complement of n, right? Now, in this case here, so n's complement here. So, n's complement is 10's complement of what? n value. Now, first I should find out what here? 9's complement of n. So, how many values are there in n? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 digits are there. So, 5 times I am taking what here? 9. So, 7, 2, 5, 3, 2, subtraction. So, what you are getting here? 7, 6, 4, 7, 2. I got what? 9's complement. Next is what? 10's complement. 10's complement is adding 1 here. Now, 10's complement of n, what you are getting? 8, 6, 4, 7, 2. So, first step is adding m to r's complement of n. So, m plus 10's complement of n. What you are getting? m value is 13250 plus 10's complement of n 27468. What you are getting here? So, 8, 5, 6, 11, 1, 4, 7, 10, 1. So, here you are not getting end carry. End carry is not generated. Why? Because M is less than N. M value is 13,000. N value is 72,000. So, here M is less than N. Then in that case, third point we have. So, the result should be given with what here? Negative sign. It should be given what here? Negative sign. And you have to find out once again the R's complement of the result. Whatever result you got, for that you have to find out what here? R's complement. So, R's complement, first I should find out what here? Nines complement here. Five nines. So, for that 40718. So, again it is 18295. Nines complement, adding 1. That is 28295. You have to place what here? Minus. Right? There you don't have this extra step. Why? Because m is greater than n. But here you have what? m is less than n. When m is less than n, further result, you have to find out what again? What? 
the arts complement of the given result and that result must be preceded with what here minus sign so if you are taking away from 72000 if you take away this 13000 you'll get what here 59000 with which sign here minus sign so what is the answer here you are getting answer minus 59282 so this is the answer right so next problem we have using binary numbers so, so till now what we have done we have done using decimal number now binary numbers say so here this problem subtraction of again unsigned numbers using what binary previous case we have done decimal numbers now here it is what binary numbers so subtract 3110 from 311010 from means what this is considered as a m and this is considered as a n so whenever you are doing subtraction of binary numbers you have to check that number of bits in both m and n should be same here now when you are checking here m so how many bits are there 3 4 5 6 7 bits are there when you are coming to n you have what only 5 bits then in that case you should add zeros to the left side of the n here so in that case m value is what m is equal to 311010 and n is equal to 7 bits are required so this left side you will add what here two zeros two zeros and given three ones zero zero now the number of bits in both m and n both are equal here so first step adding m plus n com r's complement of n so r's complement means what here two's complement of n right so first i should find out what one's complement of n so one's complement what will get 110011 again two's complement of n is what adding one here So one plus one zero with carry one one plus one zero with carry one one double zero double one. So m plus two's complement of n. Already two's complement I have. I should add what here m. What is m value? Triple one double zero one zero. So I am getting what here zero one one zero zero plus one 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 plus one is zero with carry one. One plus one is zero with carry one. Zero plus one is one. So carry have one. So now the carry is generated. I told. So if you find out the decimal value here, for this you'll get here one one four, and for this binary value you'll get twenty eight. So m is greater than n. Whenever m is greater than n, n carry is generated. Now. <coughs> this will be the answer so m minus n is equal to 0101010110 so 114 minus 28 right so this value are going to generate now next one is this one one more example reverse again subtract 110110 from this one from again see here from this i should subtract this one right now here this m is equal to 11000 and n is equal to 110310 now in n value n you have 7 digits again in case of m you have only 5 digits 5 bits so again adding what here 3 bits first step is m plus 2's complement of n First, I should find out what here. One's complement of n. One's complement of n is what? One's into zeros, right? So two's complement of n. Adding one. One plus one. Zero with complement. Carry one. One zero zero one zero zero, right? Now I should add m plus two's complement of n. Already two's complement I got. M I should add. So what is m? Zero zero one one triple zero. Now zero one plus zero is one. Zero zero plus one one. One plus one is zero with carry one. One plus zero is one zero. Now it is not generating what end carry. Why? Because you are subtracting one ten from twenty four. That is twenty four minus one ten. Right. Now in this case, m is less than n. M is less than n, right? So end carry is also not generated. Now in this case, what you have to do? 
you have to get put minus for the result and the two's complement of result has to be find out now one's complement of result is 101101 now two's complement of result is adding one here 1 plus 1 is 0 with carry 1 1 1 0 1 0 1 and you have to put what here minus in front of the result right so subtraction of unsigned number for decimal numbers have done as well as the binary numbers thank you